your father was a physician, uh, your grandfather uh, was a prominent Pakistani uh, politician. Uh, you did your research, that's a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The Wikipedia. Oh, that's on Wikipedia. Uh, <laughs> newspaper. Uh, graduated as valedictorian and then obviously matriculated at MIT. Uh, we alluded to this earlier, this is where your interest in education began. Can you talk about how you came at MIT, your work at MIT, but also sort of your upbringing and shape? Oh yeah, um, you know we're we're gonna start. You know, I, I mean, if, 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 since since you went all, all the way back, I, you know, in, in some ways, uh, you know, any anyone you know my age from South Asia who was born in the United States, you could almost like predict what their family did for a living because in 1968, uh, this was the first you know uh, there was a healthcare worker shortage. It was the first time that there was uh, essentially uh, immigration opened it up from for the most part non-European countries. So. Yeah, my, my father came in, did residency at Charity Hospital in New Orleans, 1971, goes and gets an arranged marriage to my mom. They come back, and then, you know, like the, the narrative actually became very non-traditional very fast. My, my older sister was born, I was born. And then um, my family separated, my parents separated. And uh, my father, actually, I think, I don't know, I never met him um, that I remember. Uh, I think he had some, some issues, and so it was, you know, not that, so, it started in a very traditional way, but I, I was essentially, my sister and I were raised by a single mother, and, um, and I think that informed a bunch of things that I didn't realize at the time, where, you know, you're, you're growing up, we didn't have a lot of resources, and, uh, but I was lucky, yeah, you know, this, Louisiana isn't famous for its public schools, et cetera, but I went to a, a, I would say, very mainstream school that had it all, like the good, the bad, and the ugly, I'm sure a lot of y'all attended schools like that, but in, and, and I was pretty angsty in, in high school, and, 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 um, and we were talking about that, I, I, I was. Um, but, but in hindsight now that I'm a little less angsty, I realized how many opportunities I got, however imperfect they might have been on that narrative. And, um, and yeah, but, you know, when I, when I was able to go, and there's a whole story of, you know, it's not, it's not normal from people from my high school even to, like my graduate counselor didn't even know where MIT was. He's like, Michigan's cold. I'm like, you know, anyway. Um, <laughs> it's gotten more popular since then, but even then. Um, but yeah, when I, when I was there, I, it was interesting. I, I, I kept, to, you introduced, I kept being drawn to education 